this is the uh, space multiplex condition where we're using uh, specialized devices. And here you see the, uh, the ruler device. Here is the stretchable square. This is the flip brick. And this is the, the rotor. And uh, all the targets will start moving around randomly on the screen. And the job is for me to, to match the targets as, as best as I can using the devices. And you notice that every once in a while, uh, one of the targets will, will dart off. And I need to service that right away in order to get the best score. This is a space multiplex condition where we're using the generic devices where we have a, a puck and a brick for each of the widgets. So in this, we have uh, the ruler widget being controlled. Here we have the stretchable square being controlled. This is the uh, flip brick being controlled. And this is the uh, rotor being controlled. Do you notice that there's graphic overlays for each of the tablets to let you know uh, which pairing controls which widget? And so the same as before, I'm trying to, to use the, the devices to match the targets as best as I can. This is the uh, time multiplexing condition where we're using the, a puck and one brick to control all four of the virtual widgets. And the puck is represented using the uh, arrow cursor on the screen, and the brick is used is represented with the cross uh, cursor on the screen. And in order to select each of the widgets, we have to first select one of the handles on the widget and use the puck button to attach to it. And, uh, and the brick is automatically attached to the widget. And then we can manipulate the widget and then release the button to detach the widget. And so now I can go around and try to match the targets as best as I can.